I'm Peter Stratton, co-author with Alan Carr of the Family Process paper that reports on a decade of progress with the SCORE Family Assessment Questionnaire. The SCORE team, supported by the UK Association of Family Therapy, started to work on an outcome measure specifically designed for systemic family therapy in 2005. It needed to be a self-report measure applicable to the enormous range of problems and family types that are seen in a general family therapy clinic. We took as a core assumption that an effective systemic therapy would recruit family members to collaborate on solutions. For therapeutic gains to be maintained, they would, among other things, have to create an improvement in interactions within the family, which in turn would support the capacity of the family to resolve future difficulties. To create our measure, we focused on descriptions of processes within the family rather than evaluative judgments, and we went through a full psychometric process, but with our judgments always guided by the clinical wisdom of the team, all of whom were experienced family therapists. Since the proven versions were made available, the score's been used in many countries, as evidenced in our article, but the most extensive research has been by Alan Carr and his team in Dublin. Our article reports on 15 empirical studies establishing the validity and sensitivity to therapeutic change of the score. The studies involved over 3,000 individuals from over 100 sites in four countries. There are now six versions, all derived from the original 40 proven items and devised for different uses. The longest version, suitable for research, has 40 items, and the shortest, for routine clinical use, has 15. Alan Carr's team have generated a 28-item version that's been shown to be readily usable in the clinic, but also offers a more solid base than the SCORE 15 for research. All of the versions incorporate three dimensions of family strengths, difficulties and communication derived by factor analysis. And further items which describe the family and the problem in the client's own words. Our article gives extensive detail of the strong evidence of the reliability, the validity and sensitivity to change of the main versions which have accumulated over these last 10 years. We also report the version for younger children and that for lesbian, gay, bisexual and transsexual couples. Meanwhile, there are 22 translated versions, including Mandarin and Hindi, and with many supported by the European Family Therapy Association, such as in Romanian, Polish, Italian, Spanish, Portuguese, these have been used both in the countries where our protocol for culturally sensitive translation has been followed, but also with families of linguistic minorities in other countries, obviating the need for interpreters when filling it in. SCORE has now been applied in every continent except Antarctica. In the article, we focus on the 15 research studies but our surveys of users show that many therapists are also using the score interactively with their clients to advance their therapy. Now that the score has proven validity and sensitivity to therapeutic change, there are many possibilities emerging for further research studies, both into therapy effectiveness and into family functioning. The score is fully documented on the Association of Family Therapy website it's free to use, and we would welcome your feedback or your participation in our research projects. Thank you.